Hi all. In the previous video, you have gone through a process of setting up fiscal date pattern using company names and numbers program P0010. Now look at the second option for setting up the fiscal date pattern. Run fiscal date pattern application P0008 from the first path to add a new fiscal date pattern. Program P0008 open work with fiscal date pattern form. On the work with fiscal date patterns form, click the add button to create a new fiscal date pattern. This will open setup fiscal date pattern form. On the setup fiscal date pattern form, fill up desired information according to the requirements. In first step, click in the fiscal date pattern field to enter code that identifies a date pattern. Use visual assist to select a code from user defined code. You can use one of 15 codes A to N and R that is unique to your environment. Code R is the default regular calendar pattern. In the second step, click in the date fiscal year begins field. Enter desired information. For example, April 1st, 2015. Enter date as MMDDYY. In third step, Enter period end dates in period end date field. For example, April 30th, 2015 in the first period end date, May 31st, 2015 in the second period end date, June 30th, 2015 in the third period end date and so on. Enter date as MMDDYY. In present case, you will notice that code J is used to create a new fiscal date pattern. Fiscal year beginning date is April 1st, 2015 and fiscal year end date is March 31st, 2016. 12 fields are used to identify each one's end date in the fiscal year plus 2 fields 13 and 14 for audit adjustment entries. If you leave period end field 13 and 14 blank, system populates them with the value in the end date period 12 field. In case of leap year, Ensure to enter period end date for February as 29th. When you fill up all the details, click OK to save the details. This will create a new date pattern which can be further used while setting up company for the organization. Click the cancel button to close fiscal date pattern form. On the work with fiscal date patterns form, click in the date pattern field. Enter J into the date pattern field and click on find button. You will notice the date pattern added is displayed in the records. Click the close button to close work with fiscal date patterns program. Do not change fiscal date pattern unless a company is being restructured. It is worth to note that in enterprise one code P0008 is used to create fiscal date pattern. In a previous video, we run company names and numbers program P0010 to set up fiscal date pattern. While watching the previous video, you might have noticed that there is date pattern menu attached to form menu on the work with companies form. The date pattern menu is a call to action button that redirects us to fiscal date pattern application P0008. You can use either of the two options for setting a fiscal year. However, it is fiscal date pattern program P0008 which runs behind the screen to complete the task. 